What's new at TJ Maxx? Hey, you guys, thanks so much for shopping with me at TJ Maxx. I had not been here in quite some time, so let's go ahead and see what goodies we found. I went the day after Halloween, and let me tell you, they were fully stocked. Check out these little Mickey Santas. I loved them so much. For all you Disney adults, I'm sure you like those. I did find a, quite a bit of Disney stuff. But I did swing by the pillows because I have been loving the three-piece sets. There's two pillows and one accent pillow. Surprisingly, they were cheaper than at Marshall's. Marshall's was $39.99. But here at TJ Maxx, those three-piece set pillows were for $24.99. But at Burlington, they're $19.99 for those three-piece sets. So Burlington wins that one. The rug game here was so nice. These were much more larger, so they are more expensive. But $19.99 for that I thought was pretty decent. I feel like Burlington and Dollar General have the best priced rugs. If you want something special and just unique, you might want to go to TJ Maxx and pay a little bit extra dollars for something you're looking for. But these throw blankets, this is a Rachel Zoe a collection and i love how she has the little christmas trees there i don't know what my theme is this year but everything is looking really nice these are larger blankets that you can just put overlay on your bed so they do come in queen and king and they're for about 19.99 so not too bad for the larger blankets and there's a variety they had these adorable little pillows. I love the little house one for $24.99. So I will say the pillows were more expensive when you buy them single. But these three-piece sets, I still feel like they are the best deal. But they do have them at Burlington again. So if you want to save a few dollars, go to Burlington for these three-piece sets. But I will say that TJ Maxx had a variety variety of those sets. They had a lot to choose from, just depending on what you are looking for or how you're going to decorate. You might want to just go to TJ Maxx to be safe. Some of these pillows, like you see here, were so large. They're very fluffy very very good quality and a lot of these came in sets of two when you buy them in the sets of two it's just so much more more cheaper rather than buying just one pillow it comes out to be more expensive unfortunately like this one here it's a little three-piece set super cute but then they just have of course some basic those are basic ones so for two for 24.99 was not a bad deal if you just want something basic, even those I thought were pretty cute and for a pretty decent price on these. I was walking and I saw this large gingerbread house. It was so heavy. I could not check the price underneath. I checked all the sides, but I couldn't tell how much that was. Now, TJ Maxx had a lot of these tree skirts. I'm sorry, I don't even know what they're called, but they had so many to choose from. They were mostly beige and some golds, but there were a lot of different ones. Some little decor here. I thought this one was cute, but for $16.99, I would not say that's a good deal. Some garland and some wreaths for about $39.99. I think you can find them uh, cheaper at Hobby Lobby, especially with the 40% off. I did like these little wooden snowflakes. They were for $9.99 each. What I did notice at TJ Maxx was they had a lot of stockings in sets of twos and fours. And when you do it or buy it that way, it's always so much cheaper. Right now, I really haven't found too much cheap stockings unless, of course, Dollar Tree. But the stockings I've been seeing are about $9.99 each. So the sets of two for about $14.99, some of them were running. I feel like that is a good deal. But then you also had stockings that weren't in sets and they were just one and they were running for about $16.99. So that is pretty high in my opinion. But 
again if you're looking for something unique a unique item that you are worth or risking to spend more then that that's the reason you might want to pay a little bit more for those like this one here came in a set of four and it was for $24.99. So I feel like that is the better deals. It's just going to be basically what you're wanting. I saw this little light up snowman. I thought that was cute for $14.99. Not too bad since it does light up. Some little mushrooms here. And this was a very, very large wreath for $39.99. It was large, so I would say it is worth it because of how large it was. And then you just have some more little shelf items. $5.99, you can find these shelf items at Dollar Tree. Definitely save a lot of dollars there. I'm not big on too much shelf items. I have enough already, but some are just very cute. I liked the bells on this one. I didn't find a ton of tablecloths. This one was for $16.99. I thought these little presents were so cute. Just having them anywhere in the house, they would look so adorable. This was some napkins. I loved the plaid on these. They were in a few sets here. I didn't find a ton of placemats either, but the ones that I did find, a lot of them were coming in the sets. These were some peppermint ones. I had found some at Marshall's as well, but these came in the sets of four, so not too bad either. These here were for $14.99, little poinsettias. They did have a variety of ribbon, which I don't normally see in a lot of the stores, Ross and Marshalls normally don't carry ribbon. So that was nice to see here, just if you are in need of any ribbons or special item that you are trying to jazz up. And then of course, some more shelf items. I'm not big on these shelf items, but I do feel like they are just so cute. I really did love this rattan this tree skirt. It was for $39.99. I can't really remember how much I paid for my last one, but I felt like that was a pretty decent deal. That's kind of my vibe in the living room as it was, so I thought that was perfect. I loved these little pictures. They had a few different colors here, and one had snowflakes. I feel like it would be perfect for some fresh OJ on Christmas. That was similar to, that tree was similar to the one I had found at Dollar General and they were the exact same price there. Both were $30. Here at TJ Maxx, they did have little knickknacks that you can add that are larger items. I haven't found any at Marshall, so I thought that was pretty nice. Some more little statues, just so very adorable. They have the bougie dazzled theme in one area. I felt like this little angel was so pretty. I love to do angel tree toppers. So I am looking for one of those. And this, this theme right here is just super bougie, super sparkly. This one here is just so bedazzled. $7.99 for that I feel like isn't too bad. I'm not too sure if it's because of all of the bedazzled, but it is so pretty. I did love this wreath. It had like hints of pink in it, and it was a peppermint theme. Of course, they have a variety of runners to choose from. I liked this green one. They have red ones, dark red, deep red. Some of them were for $14.99, but this one that had more jewels on it ran for $24.99. But the basic ones were about $14.99. I just did a Dollar General video yesterday. And if you saw that, you saw that the runners were for about $6 and $7. So if you want to save money again, a Dollar General might be the spot. But if you're wanting something a little bit more higher quality, then Marshalls or TJ Maxx, of course, would be the spot. I did love this little Grinch set. I feel like you can give this as a gift to anyone and would appreciate it. Then I also found some Joffrey's coffee. If you are a Disney adult or go to Disney at all, you know Joffrey's is the spot. I did love their little glass selection. Both of these were really cute. 
my kids and i were taking in all of the snow globes we just loved them so much they were so adorable and cute i see jesus you see jesus this was a hand soap collection. I'm big on hand soaps. That was for $9.99. And oh my gosh, you guys, they had so many holiday dresses to choose from. I honestly could not choose which one I loved the most. But you let me know which one was your favorite. All of them were just so shiny, sparkly, and just gave you those holiday vibes. But of course, you can wear them for any event. I went ahead and tried on this pink one. They did want have it in black. I'm wearing a size small and it was so comfortable. The under layer on this was silk, super soft. So that was a win. When I had saw this here, I thought it was so cute with the skirt with matching sweater. It did come together. It was for $39.99 and they did have a black option and a gold option. But I went ahead and tried on the silver option. And what do you guys think about this? I thought it was cute, but the sweater was itchy. It does give off this little furriness to it. So it was too itchy for me. But they just had a ton of sets going on. This was a silk one for $39.99. This was a velvet maxi dress. I loved this one as well. This gold one reminded me of a Marilyn Monroe dress. I just loved the, all of them, but I tried on the gold one and it was so comfortable. I tried on a size six, I believe, and it fit perfectly. This was another really basic black long sleeve dress. And this, this color, the teal on this color was just so nice. Another two piece set, except this one came with some pants. I love these types of sets. All of them are really nice. This year, this was a romper. This was another two-piece set with some jewels hanging off of it. I hadn't seen this one. Otherwise, I would have tried it on with the other ones. I thought it was so pretty, as well as this blue one. I did see this one at Marshall's last week, but I didn't see it in this color. I love this little pearl mesh shirt. It was for $16.99. And I thought these sweaters were so cute. They came with a headband and the quality seemed very nice. Of course, I had to go through all of the gift sets and I loved these Michael Kors little fanny packs. They were for $29.99. So not a bad deal whatsoever. This is such a great gift to give someone still keeping it name brand but not spending too too much i feel like steve madden always has some of the best gift sets for christmas i always get the scarves beanies and mittens i did get one last year that came with a little purse and they're just such good quality another thing worth gift giving i feel like i've given them in the past and i hope my girlies liked them i feel like they did this pattern here was so pretty and most of the Steve Madden gift sets are for $24.99. So really a great deal in my opinion. All of these gift sets are running about the same price. At Burlington, they had a ton of them. And at Ross, they have had a few of the perfumes like the Juicy Couture. And all of those items are the same price. So you really are not going to save anything at any particular store. Like this one, I've been seeing it everywhere and it is the same price. All right, you guys, I want to thank you so much if you stuck with me through to the end. And until next video, bye, you guys.